Nice. I'm starting it now because uh, why not? It's already started. Is it one? Yeah. <laughs> episode <I> one. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what I'm going to end up calling this in the end. I don't care what you call it. The only shitty name I have, I shouldn't, that's not PG. The only bad name I have ahead of time is, of course, the Avraticast. Hey, I agree. Let's do it. Fuck, let's do it. Are you saying let's you agree it's it. bad or yes, you agree? I agree it's terrible, but do it. <laughs> Trump did it. His name's on everything now. Oprah did it. She knows her name's ugly. That's why she put it on everything, too. She's like, I don't know where I'm going with that one idea. Any case. Episode one, shots fired everywhere. <laughs> How is... Uh, holy cow, it's weapon no, shop. No, holy potatoes. Whatever. It's a weapon shop. It's fun. I like it. I'm, I'm, I'm learning. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> I'm having fun. I like it. I'm, I'm, I'm learning. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> I'm having fun. That's good. Well, yeah, they're going, woo! <laughs> I mean, we can't look at that, because remember, this is just sound. I'm telling you to look at it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I am looking. No, Thank don't. Chris. Ten years from now, when you're big and famous, and you've blowed up, we can do we'll look back on this, we can do, and you'll laugh. <laughs> we can do Skype call. Uh, podcasts probably video ones too yeah like the co when you're famous thing. people want to see you oh <laughs> for whatever reason yeah I don't know what was I going to say just before that part I had something remember. I don't remember and now I'm thinking too quickly because I'm like oh I have to fill time for sound yeah and nah, I you gotta calm down there <laughs> yeah oof oof that's that's. you can even tell in my being like oof I can't even <laughs> what you want what were you going to say um that today, to date this, of course. Today of all days. It is. February 28th. At? 5.59 a.m. on yeah, the we, East Coast. We gotta wrap this up. <laughs> it's um, too late. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Go ahead. <laughs> it is too early. I woke up three hours ago. Now it's time for the life story. <laughs> Here we go. This is what everybody's wanted to hear. Yeah, so. I don't want to Oh, man, I have a headache now. <laughs> Just thinking about it give you a headache. Look at that. <laughs> Look at you. You're doing great. But yeah. Uh, Where do you begin with this? I don't know. We're 40 seconds in. That's it. 40 seconds. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I feel like it's been seven minutes. <laughs> and the thing, people do upwards of three hours. Yeah, I'm pretty sure off topic, like, every episode is over, like, two hours just about. That's so. a, you know, those are the dream. But we also need like five people. people. I'm pretty sure off topic, like every episode is over like two hours just about. That's so. a, you know, those are the dream. But we also need like five people. people. Yeah, and there's like four to five to sometimes six of them. Yeah. And they actually have stuff to talk about because they <coughs> hang out with each other on a day to day basis. Yeah. And that's why. So I'm, the fact that we've known each other for 11 years and have nothing to talk about shows we're good friends. <laughs> yep. But, uh, that's why I wanted the first one to have, of course, Chris, Cody, and Logan as well. In which case, maybe 10 minutes is, I could just fill in from the Tomatoes and Flames thing that you said will never make it. <laughs> oh, dude, that'd have been great. <laughs> just like a hard cut to, sh- like, just terrible, like, quality audio. <laughs> uh, yeah, but none of them would have been on it because they're like, oh, the one, do that, do that, do that, do And then Cody's like, no. Uh, yeah. I mean, I'm always down for stupid crap like this. Because I get entertainment out of it. I don't care if it goes anywhere or not. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'm always down for stupid crap like this. Because I get entertainment out of it. I don't care if it goes anywhere or not. Yeah. There's still <laughs> those fucking Mario and Sonic Generation Chris, speed runs I please. did nothing with. PG. You can't drop fucking bombs everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> My apologies. But, um, there's still those Mario and Sonic Generation speed runs we did nothing with. I did nothing with you. Yeah, I was gonna say I give you the footage. <laughs> I beat your time at your game, your own game. Mario sixty four is not my game. Super Mario Sunshine is my game. I was talking about Sonic. I beat you. Oh, did you? Yeah, by like ten seconds. Oh, <laughs> who did I beat? I don't. We didn't do anybody else because no one else joined in. Oh, that's right. <laughs> what did I win at then? Mario. Oh. Yeah, and then I did the. the oh end. yeah, because I was like. Pretty much technically one one. It was the going to the top of the mountain, right? No, we did the first 
up to go through. You caught up at the very end. Yeah, dude. <laughs> and then I did my whole little victory thing at the end, and it was 10 seconds or whatever too late. Yeah, you did. <laughs> and I was a sad boy, and I just never opened it. I forgot. <laughs> you didn't upload it because... I you, couldn't think of a name of it for you, it. You didn't want to... You didn't want to show everybody that you got beat by a fucking loser. I am not a coward. Are, are you not? Because I, I feel like you are. Wait, we're five minutes in? Are we? Hey. I don't know. That's it? I don't believe that for a second. It says right down here, five minutes and 37 seconds. <laughs> I guess let's get it. I really don't believe that at all. I don't believe it at all either. I think it might just be pushed ahead a little. Yeah, probably. But still, that means we're like, what, four minutes in? Maybe three minutes? Yeah. Maybe a minute and 20 seconds. <laughs> Perhaps. Perhaps. So how long are you trying to run this thing? <laughs> Perhaps. Perhaps. So how long are you trying to run this thing? <sighs> Anything else? All right, yeah. Here. I'm, oh, uh. I'm literally just sitting over here clicking through this game. Don't even know what I'm doing. Probably going to lose everything. I uh, just got a $5,000 grant, though. So, <coughs> doing good. So about this, uh, about this, uh, the whole reason we're here. What is the whole reason we're here? Uh, you, Elaborate. You wanted to talk about a lot of how things. much of your life is just complete and utter shit. <laughs> we like can get into that later but... on. I can get into that later. <laughs> That's fair. However, today, the 28th, uh, I guess, because Tekken 7 updated, that means Julia Chang and Negan, or whatever that boy's name is from Walking Dead, or now. Negan. Sure. Negan. I don't even watch the show, I know that. <laughs> <laughs> Any case... They are now in Tekken 7, updated. Yeah, but Walking Dead sucks, and... Uh, there's backlash what? I said, and there's backlash, we're shut down forever now, sorry. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, no, Walking Dead sucks. Most people prefer 2D, 2D fighters anyway. So, but, it, oh. I, I did actually enjoy playing Tekken again. <laughs> Yay. Uh, the point I was going to make there is, uh, I was going to think of my favorite characters and what their story arcs are, because I've thought about that for a little bit at work last week. Which one I wanted to do this last week, but I didn't do it. Favorite characters in Tekken, or yeah. Ah, oh, okay. Go so on. of course we got number one, Paul Phoenix. His thing is he wants to be the strongest in the universe. That's it. He won Tekken three, but then True Ogre happened after he left, and then Jin technically won Tekken three. Yay! Yay! Uh, <laughs> number two, Lily. She she just wants her dad to love her or something i don't know she and is a daddy's girl comes. yeah i know that's the point that's why i started thinking about it <laughs> it's a daddy's it girl comes. yeah i know that's the point that's why i started thinking about it <laughs> that's not why i like her though but uh number three was who was it who was number three mm-hmm. or i'm thinking i'm thinking gameplay wise some of my favorites i would figure it'd be nina oh yeah nina forgot about her called it <laughs> Uh, her, she's an assassin who constantly flips between good guy and bad guy, I think. Because she's helped Jin, she's helped Kazuya, she's helped Heihachi, she's helped probably others. I can't remember. Uh, number four, Kazuya Mishima. That was probably not a good idea at all. <laughs> Jesus, that spike. spike. <laughs> number four, Kazuya Mishima. His thing is, he got thrown off a cliff by his dad and he wants revenge. <laughs> Once again, stumbling around. <laughs> Number five, Heihachi. His thing is. Once again, stumbling around. <laughs> Number five, Heihachi. His thing is. He wants the devil gene from his son and wants to kill him because of Kasumi. Kaz- Kazumi. I keep forgetting it's a Z and not an S. I there keep thinking go. of uh, Dead or Lives, Kasumi. Mm-hmm. I hate that their names are so similar. Uh, so that also leads into that. Number six, Jin Kazama. Uh, his gimmick is, he's a devil, and also wants to kill the rest of his family, and then I'd probably kill himself to finish off the Mishima bloodline. Uh, I approve. And especially in Tekken 4, he, he wants to kill Kazuya. And, or since Tekken 4, he's wanted to kill Kazuya. Uh, number seven, I think. Uh, Asuka Kazama, the one who's not related to any of the characters. No, she's related to all of them. But her story doesn't relate to any of them at all. That's more my deal, if anything. Uh, <laughs> related to all my family, but we don't relate to them. Um, 
Number it's not being a black sheep. <laughs> number eight. Uh, who would be after her? King. He's a wrestler. That's it. <laughs> He's a wrestler. If you like wrestling, go on. Yeah, that's his deal. That's his gimmick. Uh, and Armor King, I guess, would be tied. I hate this light. Um, I need to put my charger in for it to stop doing that. I'm running through these boys. Uh, as far as I really got in my thinking when I was a Groger, I didn't even put King in that list, so I kind of just made that up. Also, he does the Rainmaker, which is... I don't even know how to say his name. Because... I'd have to look at it to realize. In any case, Okada's finisher in New Japan Pro Wrestling. If you put on his cape. I remember you showing me that. No, I didn't. Because it didn't do it. No. That's what you <laughs> tried. I'm still mad about that. I, uh... He's cool. Oh, yeah. He... I don't know what his deal is. No one does. <laughs> He's just there. He captured Devil Jin in his ending. And that was the impo only important thing he did. And also, I don't think it was canon. Probably not. <laughs> so. Still the that? best character. Just saying. No. Just saying. Disagree. He Ooh, is. Entirely. Dude, he's a badass. <laughs> well, yeah. yeah I, exactly. I don't know why I, I shook, know why you shook your head no at that. Like, he's was, totally a badass. I was just set on saying no to everything at that point. When you walk up to it, when you're a Russian general, first off, you're already a badass. When you're a Russian, you're already a badass, first off. <laughs> Russian general is a second tier. Russian general who captured a demon who doesn't say a word ever. And also in the opening just shoots a building with a tank for some yeah, reason. Yeah, it's fucking awesome, dude. Who knows why? Because he's Russian. But then on top of that, the same opening, you have... Uh, God, I love him. You have uh, Lily being captured by a bodyguard or whatever. Into a limo. That's not good. Then it cuts away. That's also not good. And then about a, yeah, no, she died. And then twenty <laughs> seconds later, it cuts back to her kicking the bodyguard out onto the highway, freeway, and then uh, he's fine. And then she jumps out. The limo explodes while she's turned around because you have to look like a badass and not look at the explosion. And uh, I never understood that. Anytime I blew stuff up in real life, I always looked at it. And then does her uh, one three grab, which is square X, because I don't. I assume that's one three. I'm not sure. I'm not good at arcade terms because I didn't fucking play the arcade. Um, Got him. <laughs> Go uh, self call out. <laughs> I think that's right though. In any case, she does that, so she does the little turn around thing, and then just does like an axe kick right into the his head into the ground. And that's the end of her for that end opening. Uh, and then she does nothing at all of any importance. Did they ever... That's the end of her for that end opening. Uh, and then she does nothing at all of any importance. Did they ever... Did Tekken 7 give any more story to Sergei or no? Did you do the character story thing? Because I don't remember. Yes. What you but, saw is what you got. Yeah, okay, there was nothing then. <laughs> That's exactly what I was going to say. Yes, but there was literally nothing. Like, it just. Everyone was completely irrelevant in 7 except for the Mishimas. Uh, yeah, you're not Kuhn. wrong. And even uh, even Bob, especially, because if you actually watch his ending because he skipped it. Uh, Bob's always been relevant. He beats up Brian. They fall through the, the floor, and then it just goes Bob never made it to the tournament. So he's his appearance in the game is kind of on canon, right? <laughs> nice. They put him in one game as a spin-off character, and then he's immediately non-canon the and next. And then immediately non-canon the next. Buried. Good job. <laughs> Completely buried. Get destroyed, kid. Slim Bob wasn't any good either. Still saying my favorite intro of any characters is when Sergey's crawling on the ground <laughs> doing that like waddle thing. <laughs> Shit makes me laugh. I don't know what my favorite would be. Well, I'm biased towards him because he's the best character. Just Asuka coming in on her, on her bike, which is a callback to the Tekken 5 opening. Uh, Paul doing the Phoenix Smasher deal into uh, a wall. I stuttered in the middle of saying it. That I heard. heard. <laughs> that was weird. Uh... Or who else do I play? Nina running up, shoot, or pointing the gun, and just saying "going somewhere" is nice. That's cool. It works better when I have the Bullet Club shirt because she has a gun instead of the wedding dress. 
I was gonna say something. Never mind. Oh, <laughs> also on the note of wedding dresses, Anna, of course, still has the best outfit in Tekken Seven, and also Anna is not a good character, and I've never liked her, but her outfit is amazing in it. I love it so much in Tekken Seven, and also Anna is not a good character, and I've never liked her, but her outfit is amazing in it. I love it so much. I agree with everything you just said. <laughs> it took 25 years, but I finally agreed with you. <laughs> nice. Uh, God, it's just so good. I can't go. I need a statue, please. Please, Harada. <laughs> <laughs> That's not weird. the ASMR portion of our podcast. Oh, I can do that. <laughs> I forgot. God. I'm never going to do that. It's, it's weird. That is really weird. Yeah, I've listened to it a few times, and then I was like, ah. And then I was like, yeah. I was going to say something during the midst of your rant, and I totally forgot what it was. I ran through all that way too quickly. Yeah. And uh, now I'm just back yeah. to normal, I guess. <laughs> um, oh, yeah. You going to get Devil May Cry 5? Yeah. I'm super fucking hyped for it. The only games I'm going to get this year so far are number one, uh, Dead or Alive 6, I guess, because it comes out in three days. I haven't heard a thing about it. I didn't even know it was coming out. <laughs> it's Dead or Alive 5, but with worse frame rate. Yay, <laughs> worse frame rate. It might have been, it, it might have been lag. I couldn't tell, but something was going on in that demo. I didn't even online. like 5. Five. I barely liked four. Four was great. Five was trash. Never played any of the other ones before that. <laughs> uh, not never mind. That's because they're all. Is it Dead or Alive? Just nothing but fan service anyway. Yeah, and that's why everyone's mad because they covered them up somewhat yeah. in six. And everyone's like, "Oh, how and fucking then, dare you cover the teeth?" And then Evo Japan last year they had like two, or not last year, last week they had like two uh, models or whatever, just like groping each other in it. It was something. And then they got turned off. By Evo themselves, and the guy's just like, this doesn't represent our core values. That represents my core values. <laughs> and so, now they're not at Evo this year. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> you you, you kind of screwed the pooch there. So now we're getting Samurai Showdown, a game that doesn't come out till summer. Could not care less. And Undernight, a game I never heard of until Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle, and I'm sure you're going to say the same thing, and you probably didn't even know to begin with, even until uh, just now when I just said it. Everything you said is factual. I could not care less. Never heard of it before in my life. You fucking called me out right there. And then all your others. Melee is out. And uh, Smash Ultimate is in. And now on the note of Smash, we got Liquid Salem. I guess out of Liquid. Hello. Um, some. All they are. I don't know esports. I don't follow esports at all. I don't either. Oh, I know someone, or who was it? Sonic Fox uh, on Twitter was like, I'm going to play Daisy. And someone's like, oh, you should play Snake. And then he just did a whole thing, a whole deal, like why Melee is trash, why Mango is trash, etc., etc., etc. My years of research have led to this moment. I'm just getting fucking heated over here. <laughs> Hello once more. Wow. I bought a Blue Yeti. I can see that. Yeah, and so now we're attempting to do podcasting finally. Uh, see. Mm, good luck. <laughs> <laughs> Anything at all? No. No. Thank. Right. Ah, right. oh, the next round's out. Let's see. Ah, oh, they all fucking suck. <laughs> Wait, what? Next round what? Don't worry about it. Okay. <laughs> um. <clears throat> I was going to tell you, Caleb Kitten, a buddy of mine from work, came over last night. Uh, dude's pretty solid at Smash. And first person he used of all people, Daisy. <laughs> I was so pissed. <laughs> I was like, you don't know how many times I've played against this character. <laughs> I won because... Blood is boiling. Yeah, I could see it in your eyes. You get kind of mad there. <laughs> uh, I don't. I rarely play her, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> yeah, well. I'm just happy she's in. Yeah, well. Yeah, well. I wish more people played Smash. 
I don't know what you mean by that because I just wish I had more friends that played it. <laughs> okay, I was gonna say because there's like 13 million people who've bought it. Yeah, well, I, I know two. <laughs> Uh, Three now. Let's see here. Uh, what was I talking about before? Oh, yeah. Salem. In any case, he got kicked out because he was making fun of Melee not being in Evo. Which. <laughs> Look at those cats. Which, as far as I can tell, it's all it was. Uh, I know nothing about esports stuff. Same. I just know the years, the years of research thing because I saw on Twitter the day before, like on Christmas Eve, and that. That was a great time to be awake. Uh, any case, that was all relevant. Take it, it back. Know a little bit about Rocket League esports. What's it? I don't at all. That's because I actually watch Squishy do his stuff on stream and stuff. I don't watch any of them. I can't uh, stand watching him. When he's a mechanical god and I want to be good at the game, I watch him. What, what were we talking about before that? Why was I talking about? That? Oh yeah, Evo, Dead or Alive. Oh yeah. Okay. And uh, we're back. <laughs> Number two! <laughs> uh, what comes out after that? Team Sonic Racing. Gay. Hopefully it's as good as All-Stars Racing. Gay. Transformed. It won't be. They both suck. Bad. <laughs> Number three! Crash Team Racing. I'm hype as fuck, boy. <laughs> Same, but also I have no faith in it being good. I do. Because the developer, from what I can tell, does, like, Mostly ports and like Guitar Hero Smash hits. Smash hits was good. I it had all the good songs. <laughs> I played like two minutes of it. I don't even think I played two minutes of it. Uh, Wait, how did you only play two minutes? One song is longer than two minutes. I don't know. It's an exaggeration. I was like, so you had at least play three or four minutes. Oh. Um, number four. Number yep. four. <laughs> Uh, Mario Maker 2. I'm hype. Yeah. I'm hype. It looks like it's going to be good. I'm wondering about your fridge. Do you want about your fridge? She, take a guess. Get the shit out of here. Where did I put my Sprite? I don't know. Oh, it's over there. Um, I thought it was in the fridge the whole time. I'll probably go get that. I'll get it in a minute. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Number four. I wanted to play it on Wii U. I did not own a Wii U. I wanted to play it on 3DS. You could not share levels on 3DS. So now we have Switch. Yay! Hey, for your Mario Maker? Yeah. I didn't know it came out on DS. Yep. Came out 2016, maybe? Well, bugger mine. My... Wii U. I did not own a Wii U. I wanted to play it on 3DS. You could not share levels on 3DS. So now we have Switch. Yay! Hey, for your Mario Maker? Yeah. I didn't know it came out on DS. Yep. Came out... 2016, maybe? Well, bugger my ass, then. I didn't fucking know. Go to Walmart. You can get it, probably. Nah, because I sold my 3DS. Rip. <laughs> F's in the chat, boys. F. I'm going to grab my drink. You do that. Go ahead and banter with yourself. Is there anything else? I guess 5 is Dead or Life, or Dead, Dead, Devil May Cry 5. Yeah. By default. Number 5. Well, Devil May Cry 5. You what? No, I said Dead or Alive 6. Ah, you did. <laughs> uh, I can't think of anything else coming out except for... Oh, thank you. Hopefully that's not loud. Uh, <laughs> Literally, because I can. <laughs> nice. Nice. <laughs> um... Yeah, Devil May Cry comes out on Chance's birthday. Coincidentally, who is my best friend, because I've known him since like kindergarten, so for 20 plus years. I don't know his birthday, so that doesn't really tell me anything. <laughs> Come, Devil May Cry comes out the 8th. Of? March. Oh. Like, 10 days. What happens on the 7th, besides my mom's birthday? Something else is happening that day. Or 9 days, my bad. But anyways, fucking... <laughs> Next Friday, pretty much. Language, my good sir. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> pretty much next Friday, Devil May Cry 5 comes out. Coincidentally, his birthday, right? Yeah. Didn't think about it until we were both like 14. My dad's birthday 14. My dad's birthday is the same day. 
But anyways. Mm. I don't remember what the seventh was. What? Besides my mom's birthday. It tastes flat. Um <laughs> probably is, but go on. Yeah, there's a good chance. Um March seventh, two thousand nineteen. I think I said eighteen earlier. Um You probably did. There's a good chance. You retarded. <laughs> Um, is the day that I'll have been at Kroger for one year. I do apologize to you greatly, good sir. <laughs> it's fine. It's good. The Sprite, not Kroger. <laughs> right. Um. I don't think I'll do that now. Uh, what I was gonna say was, uh, I'd say the only new game, I don't really have a I do technically, which is probably third on the list. Um, second would or first would definitely be uh, Sekiro: Shadows Die Twice. Come I forgot about it entirely. On, like the twenty six or whatever, because you know Dark Souls. Everybody loves Dark Souls. Um, Can't wait for it to be sh- trash. Yeah, it probably will be. I'm I'm ready for it. <laughs> I'm still gonna play it. And fucking the only other really thing game besides Crash. The only new game I have looking forward to is uh, Ghost of Tsushima, which... Also forgot about that entirely. Another partial Dark Souls clone. By the way, Sucker Punch, please bring Infamous 1 and 2 remaster. Do it. I or, want to play Infamous at 60 FPS, Or please. don't. Infamous is pretty boring after you beat it once. Yeah, but I just want to play it <laughs> in the 60 FPS. You'll play for five seconds and get bored of it and never touch it I again. I will not. I loved Infamous 2 when I played it just before coming to PS4. The only you reason I play it all. The only reason is photo mode. That was the second. The only reason I play it all. The only reason is photo mode. That was the second son. Oh, okay, yeah, you're right. The only reason I stopped playing two was because I got a PS4, and also because I started working at Walmart. How how does uh how does this, how does this picture make you feel? That's lewd. <laughs> <laughs> also, fuck Walmart. Also, something I've always wanted to say on a podcast. Shout out to shout outs. <laughs> <laughs> and from that, shout out to 2015 and 16. Yeah, 2015 was a great year. That was my final peak. Yep. Your final peak was in 15? Yeah. I think mine was in like 12. <laughs> RIP me. 2001 was a peak because that's when all most of the music and stuff I like came out for some reason. And wrestling was really good, and also really shit, shit right after. Uh, uh, what? I actually, didn't I said because you listen to bad music. Oh, okay, thanks. Uh, I, I'm well aware. Don't worry. I had a dream about me listening to bad music. Don't worry. Of course you did. <laughs> I'm glad you know it's bad. You you still like it. That's what a true fan does. 2012, of course, the year we graduated high school. You said 2005? I said 2012. Okay, I was like, Chris, that's wrong. <laughs> but go on. Uh, that summer was really good. That was a great summer. And also, that was during the year of CM Punk's WWE title reign. So hey. He was the champion the entire year. Hey. 434 days. There's from, more. That's more than a year. He won it from Alberto de Rio. Isn't that guy like in jail or something because of cocaine or something? I don't think that's the case. Uh huh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He got fired from TNA though. <laughs> of all places. Yeah, it wasn't it for good. Dario. Isn't that guy like in jail or something because of cocaine or something? I don't think that's the case. Uh huh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He got fired from TNA though. <laughs> of all places. Yeah, it wasn't it for drugs? I don't remember. I couldn't tell you. Uh, um, okay. Either at, way, fuck that guy. At Survivor Series 2011, and then he lost it to. Dwayne, the Dwayne Dwayne, at Royal Rumble 2013. Dwayne, the Dwayne Dwayne? Yes, I just wanted to say Dwayne a lot. Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Oh, okay. <laughs> Rock the Dwayne Johnson, rather. Hey! There's one I beat the world record for that one game. Outrunner. Outrun 2, Outrun I think. Outrun 2. No, Outrun 2 is a Genesis game. It's the remake on the Xbox. Oh, okay. The original Xbox? I didn't know they remade it. I thought there was just a new one. I <laughs> still need to put that in actual video form and submit it to the Speedrun Archive. Fun fact on you. Because I got it for free because PS Plus. Yeah. 
Speaking of Stone PS Plus, play. holy crap, this month's games are bad. I haven't seen them. I already don't remember what they are. That's how bad they are. Let's look them up. That's exactly what I was about to do. I wonder what the games for gold games are, though. Because they've been pretty good. It must be nice. Too bad Xbox One's trash. Not a lie. I know it's not. Uh, are we getting hey, Xbox. Modern Warfare 1 remastered? Fix your fucking OU. UI. Um, UI. You, uh, your HUD, your dashboard, everything. Just the dashboard because, boy, it's a lag. Boy, it's trash. Yeah, the we're Witness, getting the Witness and Modern Warfare, Warfare remastered. remastered. The one that they retroactively added loot boxes into and retroactively took out... No, not retroactively. Uh, they took out the DLC and sold it separately on like every other remaster in the world. Yep. Usually, and also get, made it cost more. Usually, if you remaster a game, you get the DLC. For, you get the DLC for free. Yeah. <laughs> this one was like, oh no, we're Call of Duty. Let's fuck it up again, because that's what they do. Yeah, that's all they've done for the entire time they've existed. We're gonna turn this. T- we're gonna change the name of this to the Let's. What, what can we shit on today podcast? <laughs> Xbox One games for kids, girls, sale. Toddlers, women, couples, teens, six-year-olds, gold March 2019, four-year-olds. I like that one of those is actually the correct one, though. <laughs> Adventure Time Pirates of the... something. Okay. Garden Warfare 2! Let's go. I love that game. And I don't need EA Access anymore. Nice. Star Wars Republic Commando for okay. Xbox Original. And Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. Let's fucking go! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wait, so you get four games? Yeah, two for each, each half of the month. Step your shit up, Sony. Reminder that we used to get six from PlayStation. Step your shit up, Sony. Two PS4, two PS4, and shout out to sh- shout outs as well. Step your shit up, Stealing Sony. Stealing your gimmick. Shout out to shout outs. <laughs> that was my favorite quote of 2015. Easily. <sighs> Easily. Who said that? Was it like Gavin or something? Uh, it was Michael. Michael. It was okay. Michael. Because like Gavin said that. something, he was like, shout out to that. And Michael's like, yeah, and shout out to shout outs. <laughs> and your boy lost his shit for some reason, because I'm retarded and I think that's funny for whatever reason. <coughs> now, the other part, which was, why, no, not why. If you want, just so we can speed through this thing, we can get back to how I complain about a lot of my life. Here we go. This is what it's all about. The only part that matters. <laughs> this is what you went out and bought this for. Yeah. The only part that matters. Don't is, speed through it. Don't speed through it. Is I was supposed to. No, I was told in August of 2017. The only part that matters. Don't is, speed through it. Don't speed through it. Is I was supposed to. No, I was told in August of 2017. Yo. In April or May, maybe. We're moving to Vegas. I'm like, okay. I don't necessarily want to go back to Vegas. I want to go back to California, but it gets me closer. But my dude was so happy to be finally going back to the West Coast. Yeah, and also <laughs> it leads into why I don't give a shit about Final Fantasy anymore. So, which is even better, you see. I didn't even know that, I don't think. Uh, just because I never bring it up, because I remembered that that's the reason. <coughs> Let's get it. I'm going to learn something new about you. December 2017, uh, Enix was like, yo, we're doing... A free trial of Final Fantasy fourteen. I'm like, yeah, boy. And then just before my trial runs out, they're like, yo, because you played on a preferred server, because they need more people on certain servers, so they made it preferred so you get double experience, which... Boy, uh, same with RuneScape. Unless you do roulettes. <laughs> Any case, just before it ended, or right after it ended, they send an email being like, yo, since you got to level 30, here's an extra two weeks or a month or whatever it was. I'm like, okay, cool. And then, because I joined, or I got on Final Fantasy, because I was like, dang, I'm moving, so maybe, for some reason, uh, it'll make it easier for me to transition over to Vegas, so I won't feel, quote-unquote, as lonely. Uh, any case, that's that part. Uh, we then go into February, or March, and my mom's like, yo, you need to get a job or whatever, so that you can get $300, so that you can pay for the plane ticket. I'm like... I don't want to do that, but whatever. And then, I do that. <coughs> I started Kroger. And then, after like a week or two, I got that stuff. And I was like, oh, well, I guess I'm out pretty soon. And then, April comes. I'm like, yo, I see we haven't packed. After like a week or two, I got that stuff. And I was like, oh, well, I guess I'm out pretty soon. 
And then April comes. I'm like, yo, I see we haven't packed at all. I'm like, uh-oh, this is not good. Uh-oh. <laughs> are we moving at, or are we still doing this? And I was told, uh, I was told, I don't know. I, remember, I, don't, I think I was told maybe like May <clears throat> or early June, I think. And then in July, which is not June, I asked my aunt if we were still moving. And she was like, oh, because they work at Walmart or whatever. Uh, like, oh, me and your mom are going to need to uh, get jobs out in Vegas. Because for some reason they were saying that you need a job in Vegas to even move out there. Which... I don't feel like that's true, but go on. I don't necessarily <laughs> know about that part. In any case, I was told that. And then... We definitely will not be here by next... Next summer. Is uh, three more months from now. Four months from now. Starts in June, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Four months from now. <laughs> that's not happening, clearly. Uh... Later on, I give up on that, and then in October, around court day, which is still a dumb thing that Kentucky does, uh, or at least Mount Sterling. It's not just Kentucky. What? I found out it's actually, like, most of the, like, Appalachian made, made, like, East Coast. Really? Yeah. It goes through, like, three or four different states, I think. Jesus. Okay. <laughs> Whatever. Still stupid. Carry on. <laughs> it's just a flea market. That's all it is. Yeah, pretty not much. Not even a good flea market. <laughs> it's a flea market where rednecks can walk around town with guns. Pretty much. In any case, around that point. But yet, n- no one gets shot. Yeah, because guns are the problem. Go okay, on. Yeah, I don't. We don't need guns. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> any case, uh, October, which was court day, comes around, or maybe November. Okay. Uh, it, was, it was around that point. Uh, I asked my mom, "Yo, is this even happening at this point, at all?" And she said, "Quote unquote." <clears throat> don't get your hopes up. Got him. <laughs> and I was like, well, got him good. fuck it. That's just another notch in me not wanting to be here because the only reason I stayed was, one, because I was like, well, let's just see, just in case Kroger just randomly decides to fire me. And two, uh, the only reason I stayed was because I was trying to get to Vegas, at least, and to California. So I had no reason to stay. And so which two months later, or one month later, I moved out. Though that's not the entire reason I moved out, but that's beside the point. That's relevant. Uh, so that's that story, I guess. And, oh, and no, or the Final Fantasy deal. One, I burned out because I put 1,700 hours into that game in less than a year. Uh, 700 of them in three months. That was not good. I don't know how that happened. Chris, I didn't play over 700 hours of Rocket League in a whole year, and you did it in three months. (laughs) It's all I did. I don't know, I don't know what overtook me. Any case, the reason I don't give a shit about Final Fantasy besides that is because, uh, at least in my groups or whatever, I'm like, well, since I don't, or I'm not moving, I won't need them to be lonely, or not be lonely anymore, so I don't need them at all. That's pretty much it. And I've been wanting to try to find a way out for, since their whole debacle in July, where they're like, oh, one person left and took his stuff out of the group's uh, deposit bank thingy. Uh, because it were, they were his items and they all knew it was his items, but he took them and left. And I guess because he didn't ask, everyone got really mad and they're like, "Oh, you're stealing!" And then he got his other friendos who were also in the group to take the rest of the stuff that was his, and then they also left. And then they made a new FC, and then everyone was like, so "He got his other friendos who were also in the group to take the rest of the stuff that was his, and then they also left. And then they made a new FC, and then everyone." was like stalking each other and going on for like a week about this and they just brought it up again like a week ago and it's been fucking weird and I don't like it and I hate all of them. <laughs> Fair enough, killer. God, calm down. Yeah. So, uh, I just did the math. Yeah. Oh my God, I'm sweating now. Yeah, you get getting high. You get a little bit heated. <laughs> I just did the math. There is 2,160, 2,160 hours in 90 days, which is about an average three-month period, yeah. you spent over a third of your life during those three months playing that game. Or at the very least, having it open and sleeping. One of the two, yes. I was going to say, you know what another third of that would have been? Sleeping. Yeah. That means, what the fuck are you doing? That's <laughs> all I did. It was eat, sleep, and that. Uh, heart reacts only. That's what I did, right? 
<laughs> she is not winning. <laughs> not even top three? Uh, no. Wow. No. That, fucking disgusting. She is second to last. Weebs are the worst people in the... Degenerates. Your boy is mad. <laughs> Complete degenerates. Weebs yeah, are. I got another one of those anime groups and they started posting that and I was like, alright, I'll vote for people. And of course, Saris, my girl. My wife. She was, uh, <laughs> she's in there. Barely got past round two and didn't even... Or barely got to round two. Did not win round two. But, uh... I got some pretty crazy pictures in that in that group. I assume they're all incredibly lewd. Incredibly lewd. E G A F, my dude. <laughs> like but, even uh, on the PlayStation <laughs> anime community thing, they all they did was just like post porn, pretty much. I just don't get the point. I, 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 I like because I, I enjoy like I enjoy talking about anime. I could do it for hours. Like when they hold on before you get into that. Like when in, in discords when they have like lewd sections or yeah whatever or like place is it all just like oh yeah i fucking jacked into this picture here you go and then everyone's pretty, like yeah i mean it too pretty much <laughs> i never understood what the point of it is going like uh, that, that was pretty much just it like i wasn't gonna say too much more i was gonna be like hey, i just don't understand the point like i mean everybody just like i mean yeah it's art cool whatever and like some pictures are really well drawn and everything yeah. but i don't need to know that you Rip the skin off your dick to it 15 <laughs> seconds ago. <laughs> it's like, all right, I get it, cool, chill. You don't gotta send nothing but these pictures. Like, we're in this group to talk about the exactly. show that's happening. And that's why I left one of the Ruby groups, because that's all it became. That's also why I can't join anime groups, because they never talk about any of the old shows. It's just the current stuff. And that's why I left one of the Ruby groups, because that's all it became. <laughs> That's also why I can't join anime groups because they never talk about any of the old shows. It's just the current stuff. That too. That too. I had that problem uh, with a Dragon Ball Z of all group. <laughs> Which is also why I can never talk to people about how hard he is the best anime. I don't like it, man. It's not great. It's not great. <laughs> At the very least, it's the best anime in movie. I can name 12 right now off the top of my head. I don't even know 12 anime. I, I can give you my 3x3. Three three. three. my head right now that's better than him. I can give you my 3x3. Three three. What the hell's a 3x3? Three three? The things where like, they post like their favorite animes and just... In, do, 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 do. So it's like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9? Yeah. Why don't you just say your top 9? <laughs> I don't know. It's just a 4chan thing. I don't know what that means, but go ahead. Sure. <laughs> In any case, number 1. Number 1. <laughs> just edit no. over it later. Number one. <laughs> just edit no. over it later. You know, starting at number nine. Actually, never mind. Because if you, I mean, you can already assume number one. Oh, we gotta work our way up, Mario. Number nine, Little Witch Academia. Didn't like it. I love Akko and Diana. Uh, Akko is a very good, good guy. Baby face. Whatever you want to call them. Well, let me let me let me rephrase that. It's not that I didn't like it; it's that it wasn't as good as I hoped it was. The opening songs were really good, and also the art for like um, the magic, like uh, Star. I don't even remember what the the teacher's name is. In any case, the the animation for like the magic was really good, especially in like the first episode and the final episode and the uh, mid mid episode, the mid season episode. Uh, number eight, I don't remember if I changed it or not. It's probably like School Rumble. Oh um, my god, why did you, oh, uh, <laughs> my heart, what? You forgot about it again. I was literally almost on the verge of t- just crying, I was so mad just now. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking finish it, god damn. Two episodes of season three. That's the most disappointing thing about the whole thing. I'm literally fuming now. God. My apologies. That was on track to be my favorite anime. You fucking got me. And we were choking up. God. Uh, number seven. <laughs> <coughs> I'm. Oof. I'm good. I'm good. I'm boiling now. I'm good. Uh, number seven. You're not going to agree in any form of this. Neon Genesis Evangelion. Watched the whole thing, did not like it. Now, number five, six and five, 
I can't remember off the top of my head for some reason. So. Boy, that must be one of your favorites. I don't know what happened unless I can find a picture, which I don't think I'll be able to find. Dude, I can't even, like, I couldn't even begin to try to, like, categorize my top ten favorite anime. I think you you can't even name that. <laughs> oh, I can name, like, a hundred, but. I don't have it saved. Uh-oh. Let me try to make a list. While you're Wait, no. It. I know. I can go to my anime list. Because I have it there. Uh, I don't. Yeah, because you're like, I use Mal. I don't know why I <laughs> said that. Uh, what was... Oh. Number six or five. I don't remember. This isn't in order. Yeah, it'd be number six. Number six. The, be- the-, the Pet Girl of Sakura Hall. Or Sakura so no pet no Konojo. Never heard of it. It's a good show. A girl doesn't really know anything except art. And there's a guy who wants to be a video game developer or something. A girl who wants to be a voice actor, actress. Sayu. Never heard of it. Probably one. Uh number five. How far it's apparently fallen. Angel Beats. Oh. Probably one. Uh Number five, how far it's apparently fallen, Angel Beats. Oh, that was the closest I've ever came in my life from a show or a video game ever coming to making me cry. I think it did. Angel Beats fucking destroyed me emotionally at the end. I was like, Jesus. I think I did cry, or just like a few tears started, and that was it. It's one of the two. Like, it was the closest I ever came to crying because of a show. Like, I still haven't yet. Fun fact, I haven't cried since I was, like, 12. I haven't cried 10. since 2015. <laughs> I just don't cry. So since I was 20. Nice. <laughs> so, side note here. The reason, of course, is because I was in California for two weeks on vacation. Yep. And you had to come back to this hellhole. Yeah. This fucking black hole. And I almost cried the day before we left. Uh, I did not. And I was listening to... <laughs> The point where I almost did fucking uh, on Spotify, uh, Shine Down's cover of Simple Man was playing. <laughs> that wasn't the reason though, but it was playing. Um, <coughs> and then the day after, I was like, "Oh dang, we have to leave or whatever." And then I woke up. I'm like, "Oh, we actually have to leave now." And then I got in the car, and I was like, "Oh, now I'm just sad now." And then from the moment I stepped into the airport until I fell asleep on the plane crying, I was crying that whole time, and uh, there was like a good 20 minutes in there. It was not fun to watch. I could barely even make it fucking through airport security doing it. (laughs) That was not good. He also got mad because I accidentally kept... He also got mad because I accidentally kept leaving fruit roll uh, wrappers in my pockets. They were not happy about that. (laughs) (coughs) That's such an odd thing for them to get mad about. I know! (laughs) Boy, I'm trying to make a list over here, and it's it's rough. I I just now got to five. Uh, (laughs) Oh. Number four is... K-On! Didn't like it. I love the music, and Mio is... Either best anime girl or second best. Depends on my mood. Uh, and also my favorite base character and what made me want to play base to begin with. That's fair. And also I want her base, but it's like $1,300 and I'm not paying for that. That's fair. Uh, number three. You, one you will agree, agree with. Konosuba. That's my number three. Oh, it's a, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you said one or three there. Okay. Oh, it's a piece of shit in it. And it's the only way. The only way I can ever describe it is it's the it's always sunny of anime. I always view it as, unless you have anything else to point out or think I'm wrong on it. That um, no, because every episode is just like some new BS adventure nonsense. So yeah, I'll give you that. Aqua's best girl. And you're wrong. (laughs) Just like that. Get the (laughs) hell out of my house. 
Everybody knows Darkness is best girl. And Chris says fucking Mega Man's best girl. <laughs> so we're all three here. We get the Holy Trinity. <laughs> uh, and also second best girl is neither of them. It is... You gonna say Wiz? Oh, what? What did you say? I said you gonna say Wiz? No, actually. Uh, it's Mega Man's friend. Oh, yeah, because... <laughs> <laughs> the one she's like, wait, we're rivals. <laughs> it's Mega Means friend. Oh yeah, because <laughs> the one she's like, wait, we're rivals. <laughs> Boy, I've had that feeling before when somebody comes to me and is like, hey man, you remember me? It's like, I know you. <laughs> I had that happen last week. I have a guy who swears we've been friends since third grade, and I've never heard of his name in my life, and he still talks to me on a daily basis, or at least tries to talk to me on. Well, not daily, probably a weekly basis. He sends me messages like, hey man, how you been? I'm like, I've been. I still don't know you, but I've been. Because when we went to go get the TV uh, last week or whatever, whenever it was, uh, someone walked up to me. Maybe it was the day before when I was just, like scouting it out, quote unquote. <laughs> um, walked up to me. He's like, oh, hey, how's Kroger been? I'm like, uh, uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> And then he's like, oh, you remember me? I'm like, uh, no. <laughs> I actually said no. I was like, uh. Um. At least you're honest. <laughs> I realized later on, he was a day shift boy. I could not put him anywhere in my mind, because I only think about the night boys. I forget the day boys ever even exist. That's fair. And I only talked to him like three times ever. That's fair. He was a car pusher guy. I don't know what else he does besides that, but that's what I've seen him do. <clears throat> so, uh. So my B, I don't remember your name, though. I can't apologize to you. I can't get Seven, eight, nine, or ten. Cool, I didn't have a ten to begin with, so eight, seven, eight, nine. Okay, uh, seven, eight, nine. Number two. Lucky star. <laughs> no. All I'm saying is no. Kagamiya's best girl, followed by Sakasa. Followed by... I don't remember the pink hair's girl off the top of my head. Followed by Konata. I don't know. Everyone loves Konata. I don't know why. I don't see it. Number one, Suzumiya Haruhi no Yutsu, or, that was very broken, everyone loves Konata, I don't know why, I don't see it. Number one, Suzumiya Haruhi no Yutsu, or, that was very broken, probably, or, yep. <laughs> The Melancholy of Haruhi Suzumiya. I love that anime more than anything, just about anything in my life. That's fair, I'll give you that. <laughs> <laughs> and it has the best movie, The Disappearance of Hardy Suzumiya. Even the sh side shows are good. The Disappearance of Nagato Yuki-chan, which Haruhi completely takes over once she appears in the show. Good job. And, uh... There was, like, Suzumiya Haruhi-chan no Yusu, which was, like, a chibi show. And there was something else with Suruya. My girl. My girl is Suruya, and of course, Mikuru. Mi Mikuru. Asahina. Ryoko's a no good no So there's my top what, nine. What was that one show? You introduced me to it. Can't uh, help you. I, uh, I don't remember. Can't help you until you give me some details. Anyways, fuck it. Just use your imagination. I don't have a number nine, I guess. I mean, I could name... We'll say number nine is Dead Man Wonderland. <laughs> Didn't watch it. I remember everyone talking about it, though. Still have not went back and actually finished it, oh. but it looked good. Also, just before you get, continue, despite SAO getting me back in anime, it's still shit. Agreed. <laughs> uh, I only got back in because I was like, oh, dang, uh, an MMO show. I'm playing Final Fantasy XIV. That's an MMO. And that was it. That's the only reason I watched it. And also because everyone's like, oh, Halfway through the season, his sister or whatever wants to bang him. It's like, oh, it just becomes a whole weird incest thing. It doesn't become that. I was going to say, wait. It doesn't become that. I was going to say, wait a minute. She, it's his cousin or whatever. And then, uh, she's like, oh, because she likes the version of him that's in the game or whatever, but she doesn't know it's him. And then once they realize they're each other, she's like, oh, no, this is bad. It's not like she felt anything after that unless I'm just making shit up. Probably. I don't know. Uh, yeah, anyways, number nine, Dead Man Wonderland, whatever, it's cool. Uh, number eight, 
only put on here because my dedication to it, but uh, One Punch Man, I did like it. It was good. Mob Psycho was better than I, I did like it. It was really fun. It was really fun to watch. Uh, I'm, only, I'm only put it on here because I actually went and took the time to learn to play the intro on guitar as well. <laughs> Uh, yeah. It's pretty fun to play. Um, number seven would be Trinity Blade. Shocker if you haven't heard of it. Wouldn't surprise me. I think I know the name. Uh, pretty much a vampire anime. Really, yeah, really good. I've heard it. Uh, four years later, fuck you, Jonathan. Oh, we <laughs> probably talked to him about that. <laughs> nah, that's alright. I don't care. Uh, number six. <laughs> Is it wrong to try to pick up girls in a dungeon? Great fucking show. I got ten episodes in, but I replaced it with Konosuba. Because it was happening at the same time, I think. I just like that he kicked Munster's ass and would level up. It was, I, I thought it was a pretty cool concept. It's an RPG anime, pretty much. Uh, number five, Demon King Daimao. I think I know that. Uh, pretty much about a kid. Like Everybody nope. goes and picks up a fucking like, uh, orb and tells you your future. I'm thinking of that like little brown guy who's called Domo or whatever. That's what you're thinking of, yeah. So and, I, uh, I don't know if this apparently, is it's like nobody's got the Demon King in over a million years and he gets it. Nice. Uh, pretty, pretty good anime. Uh, some lewd-ish scenes, but other than that, it's really good. Number four, I just picked Dragon Ball series. Um, and in parentheses, I put no, not UGT. Because <laughs> nobody talks about GT. <laughs> um, yeah, I like Dragon Ball. I've watched every bit of it in English so far. I don't like Dragon Ball. The only parts of it I do like are... The only parts I've even watched are the Cell Saga, the Majin Buu Saga, and the Android Saga. And my favorites are, of course... Super Vegeta, the roided up version of him, and not Super Saiyan Vegeta. There's a difference. I know. Okay. No one else seems to ever know what I'm talking about. I know exactly what you're talking about. Because <laughs> he was the best in the... Also, Majin Vegeta's best, but just saying. The Tekken, or Tenkaichi game. Those uh, are good. Congrats, you watched literally the best parts of uh, Super. Nice. Pretty much all of Super. <laughs> um, or not Super, but uh, Z. And was it Super. Good. And uh, I also saw like the first like two episodes, but that's beside the point. Uh, what was the other? Oh, full form. No, what is it called? Full form. Uh, Frieza. The one where it like, has the purple and just a full white. The one where it like, has the purple and just a full white. The final form. Sure, the one that they always use. Yeah, like not the, the original one or the Mecha one, but the one the, before Mecha. Yeah, like the hundred percent Frieza or whatever. Yeah, uh, him, my boy Broly. Love him. I Broly, 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 Broly. He's awful in the game, though. And uh, Android 18, because everyone does. Well, they do for different reasons, though. Yeah. <laughs> I thought she was cool looking. Yeah, so does everybody else. <laughs> in not, different ways. We'll see I'm not game. meaning that. <laughs> Don't worry. No, I Seven, actually like the androids a lot. 17, wait, wait 17, the long hair boy? Uh, 17 was the guy who was with her all the time. Uh... 16 was the guy with the uh, mechanical arms that blew off in the mohawk. Hated him. Uh, 19 was... I think 18 and 17 combined? One of them is that. I know that. Or something. I don't remember 19. I know 20... 20 was Dr. Jiro, right? Maybe. I don't know. I only remember 17, 18, 16. Wow. I feel like a fucking loser now. I don't remember And then this. 21 is the girl from uh, Fighter Z. That's the new one, right? Yeah. That's from Super. The little super long red-haired girl. Yeah. Maybe 19 was that baby guy. The one who's just like a little fat, like, talked like a baby all the time. Probably hated him. Oh, and I like Yamcha. I hate him a lot. Yeah, of course you like the guy who dies all the time. And, uh, Hercule and Vanel, of course. Did you say Vanel? I was thinking of Final Fantasy. What, what is her name? Videl. Videl. Okay, I was thinking of Vanille from Good Final old Vanilla, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we already got carrot and celery and pickles and all that stuff. <laughs> But now we got vanilla. <laughs> uh, number three, obviously, as well, Konosuba. Blah, blah, blah. Mm. Great show. Chris got me on it. Uh, number two, School Rumble, in parentheses. Fuck you, Chris. <laughs> I'm still mad about that. <laughs> um, heartbroken that did not get Rumble, in parentheses. Fuck you, Chris. <laughs> I'm still mad about that. <laughs> um, heartbroken that did not get a finished. It was the single greatest thing I've ever seen. If it would have got finished, probably would have replaced my favorite anime. Which, number one, is fucking Trigun. It's the best anime ever. I watched two episodes with Logan. Yeah, you're missing out. It's the single best anime ever. There's a dude that has a sniper that's literally over a mile long in it. 
Oh, I didn't think about what you just said. That. Like, it's a sniper that just, like, has, like, a bunch of little, like, tripod stands all the way for, like, a mile. It looks like a fucking pipeline. Um, it's such a good show. And in regards to 2 and 3, School Realm and Kona Suba, it also is probably because I would not shut the fuck up about either of them. Well, because they're good. I was just like, you all need to watch this, and no one would listen at all for the longest <laughs> time until I just forced it. I just don't like sitting down and watching anime. I got a whole list of stuff on my anime list I need to watch. Yeah, I got. And I just haven't got around. I got a whole list of stuff on my anime list I need to watch. Yeah, I got. And I just haven't got around to it. I have eighty-two shows in my plan to watch right now. Game. I need to make one of those. On top of watching ten, but I'm only really watching two of them. Also, uh, redacted, not redacted. A uh, special honorary mention to. Bunny Girl Senpai show. That was a really good show last year. That's all. I didn't mean to... Redu- I was going to take out one of them, but I was like, I don't want to go that far yet because I haven't finished it because I still have two more episodes. Uh, I have completed 70, but most of them are Pokemon. Ah, shocker. Yeah. On hold, 27. I've only dropped 15 shows, apparently. Let's see which ones I've dropped. Because <laughs> I hated them all. But they're shit. <clears throat> Actually, I didn't hate all of them. Excel World. Uh, SAO was better, and Excel World just wasn't that great. And SAO wasn't great to begin with, so. True. Uh, Erased. I didn't care. Rolls, whatever. Brandon Turner really likes that show. He was mad that I dropped that. Of course he does. Pause. Uh, take off, <coughs> number nine, Dead Man on the Land. Move everything down one, number four, Baka Test. Oh yeah, Baka Test. That's Forgot nice. completely all about it. Great show. Yeah, I bumped them out, honestly. Because when I re- tried rewatching was maybe it's because I was watching with Zach. I don't know, but for Probably. some reason it wasn't that great when I watched with him. Well, I love the death saw of the earth, but <laughs> Zach has this fucking aura about him, dude. And when you watch stuff with him, you can just feel him not caring at all about it, even though it looks like he's interested. And it just makes you, it, at least me, it just makes you like fucking enraged, and you're just like, I don't care anymore. I'm done. I don't even want to watch it anymore. Maybe because it's a thing where like I'll laugh and I'll see the other people just like not do anything, and I'm like, oh, I'm alone here. Yeah, well, you can't do that with me though. That's why I don't I'm watch things with anybody. <laughs> That's uh, why I don't watch things with anybody. Number four, kill a kill. Did not give a fuck about it. It's too over the top. Oh, I don't my. like over. T- That's uh, why I don't watch things with anybody. Number four, kill a kill. Did not give a fuck about it. It's too over the top. Oh I don't my like over top. God, things. it's nothing but fan service. So I bad. say over the top and not liking it, despite the fact I love Konosuba more than almost anything. Uh, there's a difference. I couldn't tell you what it is, but I know what it is. Konosuba has no fan service. Uh, I won't say none. Uh, that <laughs> one basketball show that Zach liked. Uh, Shit. <laughs> I watched some of it. It was right, but I had no interest in continuing it. Unless I watched it with him. Log Horizon. Another MMO show. Wasn't any good. It's too yeah. slow. I watched three episodes. Uh, Mobile Suit Gundam Unicorn Re 96. Didn't care. However, it has an amazing opening song. Uh, my my little sister can't be this cute. Shit. That was a show that people liked. Uh, I didn't really care. Persona Five: The Animation. Shit. The an- the anime didn't look that great. I wish they used whoever made the uh, cutscenes in the anime, but they did not. So, oh well. Uh, that Panty and Stocking show. Oh, well, you didn't like that? Panty and Stocking Garbell? Dude, that show's good. Maybe if I watched it 10 years ago, I would have liked it, but now, no. I watched it 2014. Jonathan made me watch it. I liked it. Uh, there were some songs I liked. Uh, Super good. Outlaw Star. I watched it with my Final Fantasy people. Trash. Did not care at all. Uh, Siren. That was like a dating sim thing. Trash. Game. Visual novel game. That was the show. Uh, I think I watched two episodes. Oh, I watched three episodes, apparently. It was good, but I didn't care anymore. Uh, Attack on Titan. Trash. <laughs> Holy shit, fuck. that's a fucking travesty. I watched five seconds. I saw the outlines on their bodies. Uh, I did not like that. I did not want to watch the show because of that. That's why I don't... That's one thing I don't like about Ed and Nettie. Yes, I do, I do like Ed and Eddie, How but I don't fucking like... fucking day. I don't like that thing where, like, they're always, their bodies... Fucking day. I don't like that thing where, like, they're always, their body's always, like, moving or some yeah. reason. I don't like that. It's called the 90s. I know that, but, like, no <laughs> other show does that. Which, that's cool. I just don't really care for it. Uh, what was this even called in English? I don't remember. Yamada-kun to seven... Nin, no, Mojo. Mojo. Yamada-kun and the seven witches. See, and that that's the thing right there. 
that pisses me off. The cover art for all these animes looks so solid, and I guarantee it's trash. Yeah, it was. Every time. And I don't even... Oh, I remember what this one was. <laughs> the saga of Tan- Tanya the Evil. Tanya the Evil. She's like some weird lolly who's a dictator or something. Did you ever watch a uh, Bakemonogatari? I watched a Brand Turner once. That show is so fucking. I was like, this show fucking sucks. I like the <laughs> Renai Circulation opening song though. Also, and I lost it. Never mind. Nice. We are. That's all I was gonna ask. Hour. How, how long are we in? An hour. We're in. That's shocking. That's good for the first one. Oh, what I was gonna say. You're going to be going through this list, and there's going to be one random Joe Randy <laughs> that decides to click on this and listen to this, and he's going to hear this list, and he's going to hunt down <laughs> our IP addresses and kill us for shitting on all his favorite animes, <laughs> and I welcome it. I welcome you, Joe Randy. Please <laughs> put me out of my fucking misery. Rando Calrissian, as Cards Against Humanity calls it. I need, we need to play Cards Against Humanity at some point. Talk to Robbie today. Um... When I was talking to him, uh, I guess the next Wednesday we're going to try to do a card game night, board game night thing. Is that what you were just talking about earlier? Yeah. Okay. That's what I, I, I thought it was card game night, board game night thing. Is that what you were just talking about earlier? Yeah. Okay. That's what I, 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 I was talking to him about it because I went down to his house to borrow it, which because he lives down there. Yeah. Because um, everybody lives back here. Apparently, as I've been finding out. <laughs> but, uh, well, he's been living back here for like upwards of eight years or something. Oh. But, uh, I've told him I'm trying to do maybe, if not once a week, once every other week, try to have just, like, a card game, board game night. Just, to, like, get just a few people, not too many, because this apartment's small as fuck, but... <laughs> like, even when it's just, like, you four, or right. you two, and then those two, it's right. like, always, like, Yeah, build. exactly. So I'm gonna try to get maybe six to eight people, like, eight people tops. Yeah, there's... Can't like if I know somebody has a third person and we're already at six, I'm just we're just gonna stay at six. Like I do not want any more than that. But I'm gonna try to get around six and have a card slash board game night. It's amazing I found it. They have every expansion. I wish I did. Trina loves Cards Against Humanity. That's why I play the online version instead. I'm not a fan of Cards Against Humanity really. It was fun to play Cards Against Humanity on my lunch break at Walmart though, with a group of like seven people. See, that seems like it'd be fun, but I didn't like anybody I worked with. They always made terrible choices. Besides Casey, that guy who came over here to play Tekken with you. Oh. Uh, and Terrence. I like the night shift, but I don't really know the day shift people at all, except for Terrence and now Casey. You're not missing out. <laughs> um, shout outs to shout outs, by the way. <laughs> once again. <laughs> the other point I was going to make, oh yeah, if we want to, because you're a sad boy for other things. Uh, if we want to bring up more sad boy things. The cinnamon roll. God damn it. <laughs> I fucking do <knew> it. <laughs> I'm never, ever going to lift that down, dude. He's fucking done. <laughs> that was way funnier than I thought it was going to be, honestly. I knew it was coming to it, so I set my drink down and everything. I was like, I fuck. that's why I just immediately did this when you said it. I was like, motherfucker. I thought you might have been going for something else there, so I was hoping you weren't. So, for anybody who's fucking actually listening to this. At this point, an hour and ten minutes in. Go on. The cinnamon room. <laughs> Was we were all at old dude's house here, my gracious host <laughs> of this fucking trash cast. Wow. Um, <laughs> we were all at old dude's house here, my gracious host <laughs> of this fucking trash cast. Wow. Um, <laughs> not had fun. I enjoyed it. Saturday. Um, we were all at his house and. They decide, let's make cinnamon rolls. Alright, cool, I'm fat, I like it, let's get it. 
So, you know how usually if you make cinnamon rolls, it has a little pack of icing, and you go in there and you put the icing on, blah, 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 sure, done, whatever. So, everybody goes and gets their cinnamon rolls and such. And I was like, hey, one more second, I'm going to go in there here in a minute after I get them. I was on fucking Steam or some shit, playing some bullshit game or something. I don't remember. Anyways, point, probably yeah. playing RuneScape. I still play RuneScape. Who fucking knows? Anyways, I walk in the kitchen five minutes later to get my cinnamon rolls. <laughs> minutes later to get my cinnamon rolls. <laughs> and this son of a bitch has the whole packet of icing <laughs> stuffed in his crawl, <laughs> squeezing the life out of it, and just looks at me, and I wish you could see his face, just looks at me with the most like, oh, oh, <laughs> like, Chris, I didn't get any icing, and then does not remove packet from his mouth, bites down and just smiles as big as he can, <laughs> and starts <laughs> laughing. <laughs> <laughs> that was the most hard cinnamon rolls without icing turns out not fucking great <laughs> that was the most heartbroken I believe I've ever been in my life ex-girlfriend left me after four years not even fucking close <laughs> family members dying not even <laughs> family members dying not even fucking close the betrayal I felt that day <laughs> was literally <laughs> fucking legendary. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and I've never lived it down. I really have. <laughs> okay. One. Make two points. One, two little points. Three points. Number one. That was seven years ago. And it's true. He has not lived it down. Number two, I, I, I'm filled with rage every time somebody brings it up. <laughs> Just cinnamon in general. Uh, it's probably why I like the churro because there's cinnamon on it. That's it. Yeah, we figured that out. <laughs> there we go. Fuck churros. Number wow. Uh, number two, I just want to make the point that of course, uh, I thought everyone got their icing. I saw there was extra left. I was and like, didn't ask. I was like, fuck it. I'm just eating. Who had? Literally went in debt like over five billion dollars, <laughs> lost everything he owned, family all ransomed and killed, and had just nothing left. <laughs> like, that's the day my spirit was crushed <laughs> forever. And number three, that is one of three of the biggest uh ohs for me. No, it all makes sense now. I haven't been happy since 2012. Nice, seven years ago, <laughs> December 2012. That, that was it. That was the last time I was happy. Nice. It's all your fault. Chris, you killed my happiness. I'm sorry. That was one of three big uh-ohs for me in my life. And which I'm going to lead that into the other two. Number three on that list, because this is number two. Uh, number three. Fuck, I figured it'd be number one. <laughs> no. It's actually not. Um, uh, number three was two days ago at Kroger. When they were like, oh, the, they're going to have floor maintenance tonight or whatever, so on that list because this is number two uh, number three fuck I figured it'd be number one <laughs> no it's actually not um uh number three was two days ago at Kroger when they were like oh the, they're gonna have floor maintenance tonight or whatever so uh who's working tonight I raise my hand I look over no one else did so no one else was working that night I'm like uh oh and they're like yo do you want to work can you work from 7 to 11 tomorrow and then also come in tonight or that night uh, from 11 to 7? I'm like, oh, guess I have to do that. That's not really that funny at all. No, just tell them no. I know. <laughs> I didn't, but I wanted another day off. So I had to. I didn't have an option. Number one, the fun one, was I was into, really into Maurice at one point in 2010-ish, 2009-2010. For some reason, I don't know why, but she was cool. And then I was talking to Jessica or whatever, and uh, for some reason in my mind, I flipped what I was going to say. I was like, oh, don't worry, I'd like Maurice more than you. And I was like, oh, oh no. Wait, what happened? What I just say? <laughs> like, hold on a second. And she's, she was not happy. And you wonder why you never went out with her. 
Okay, just tell a girl you like somebody more than her. <laughs> to be fair, Reese is fucking hot. I mean, you're right there. It's like, hold on. <laughs> like, like donkeys, uh ohs. Like in the Dark Souls remaster. Yeah, thing. Just, just, like, it's like an very like extended uh, slow motion version of that. Just, uh, uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> and, like, my eyes just shot open, like, oh no. Fuck. Uh, <laughs> Wait, fuck no. <laughs> Bob Saget! <laughs> Bob Saget! Shout out to Red Sky. I think that's a good point to end, I think. I don't think we're going to be able to top that. <laughs> that's an hour and 15 minutes. I approve. So. And it only got better the longer it went on. Yeah. So I guess I will. <laughs> so I couldn't, I didn't think of any name. In the meantime, it's 712. Uh, I should be dead right now. <laughs> I didn't think of any name. In the meantime, I guess I will just call it the Avraticast or the Raticast. Just a short. Trash cast. I can do that. Yeah, I have trash a cast. Nah, I don't do that. I don't know. In any case, it's